Hello, hello, hello guys. Welcome to the weekly vlog. It is concert day. If you can't tell by my hat, uh, my aunt will be here in just a little bit to pick me up. Uh, the concert's not till 7 o'clock tonight and it's like noon now, but we've got like a three hour drive to get to the concert. Um, it's up north and um, we're picking up my friend who lives up in Portland, which is where the concert's actually in Washington, but uh, my aunt should be here to pick me up soon. And I just got ready. I filmed actually a concert makeup look this morning and I'm just picking up around the house a little bit. I'm actually putting my laundry back in the basket because it needs to be folded and I haven't folded it yet. But I poured it all out onto the couch so I could go through it to find the jeans I wanted to wear today. And so now I'm like, okay, that needs to get put away before my aunt gets here because that looks terrible. <laughs> yeah, so I just thought I would start the vlog, say hello, good morning. Although I feel like a couple of these hairs look like they need to be curled. So I might go recurl a couple of these hairs because they look a little wonky in the camera. Maybe I'll do fold some of this laundry while I'm waiting for it because I really should. I've been sitting here since Sunday and today's Wednesday, so I really should fold this laundry. So maybe I'll do that after I go and check on my hair and see what needs to be recurled. But anyways, <sighs> I'm getting ready to go to the concert. I'm so excited. Went and saw the Jonas Brothers like almost two years ago and had a blast. I... I love the Just Brothers. I know some people are probably like, oh my god, but I'm a 90s baby. What can I say? They were super popular when I was in like middle school and early high school. Like I thought I was going to marry Nick Jonas back in the day. So can't help myself. I'm excited. I had a blast at my last one. My aunt actually said she wanted to go see him and I was like, I would go see him again. So we're going. Here we are. <laughs> so I will take you guys along the journey. I'm going to try to be good and remember to vlog today. Um, hopefully I will be able to take my camera and stuff into the venue. I've never been to this amphitheater before, so I don't know what their policies are on cameras and that kind of stuff, but hopefully I'll be able to take you guys in with me. Hey guys, so we made it into the Joe Bros. <laughs> into the venue, Ooh. and I got a sweatshirt. You're so jealous. <laughs> <laughs> we got Chipotle for dinner, and we're standing outside the arena, and we're about to head in. We're here, I don't know, about an hour early or something, and we're ready to go. We're excited. Yeah. We got our merch. <laughs> uh, we had to buy a bag because we can't bring purses in. So here's our purse now, twenty dollar purse. To twenty five, oh, but twenty five dollar. I think that's handcrafted. It's beautiful, glittery <laughs> and all. <laughs> It is glittery. It you is. Like to put your glittery and sparkly. Stuff in my purse. <laughs> yeah, I do. Okay. <laughs>
8.30 in the morning. We got home at about 3 o'clock this morning. So by the time I got undressed, got my makeup washed off, got my contacts taken out, got my teeth brushed, like all that good stuff, and got in bed, it was about 3.30 maybe 3.40, I don't know, somewhere in there. So I probably fell asleep between 3.40 and 4 o'clock. And now I'm up and awake-ish. <laughs> and I'm sitting in front of my nail place. <laughs> I have to get my nails done before our vacation next week. And I probably talked about this, I can't remember now. My nail girl, Alana is also going on vacation next week, and I don't know what day she leaves, but because she's trying to get all her appointments, that she would come in next week, which would be like me. Moved up to this week. Um, I originally had made my appointment for yesterday, not thinking about the concert, and then I was like, oh, the concert's that day. She'd probably get my appointment changed, so she tried to move me to 8.30 on the day before the concert, and that didn't work out because she thought she was just going to swap my appointment and somebody else's well they weren't able to swap appointments with me so then she uh, moved me to 8 30 this morning and so yeah it was her only option and I was like well I'm not gonna pass up getting my nails done because if I don't and I wait till after vacation my nails will be like four weeks or almost a whole month and I usually get them done every three weeks and at four weeks they are so grown out and long I usually have one or two that are starting to like lift at the back and hair will get caught under it and it's just a nightmare so yeah I um I need to get them done before vacation and so yeah I'm here waiting for her and I'm exhausted I'm so tired like literally I can feel like pressure behind my eyes because I'm that tired and like I'm a little bit like nausea just because I get I'm like I'm so tired I'm one of those people I don't know whatever happens to you guys but like when I'm like too tired or like don't get enough sleep, I kind of feel nauseous a little bit. And I haven't eaten anything or consumed anything. I didn't even drink any water when I woke up, which was probably a really big mistake. But <laughs> yeah, I'm so tired. I, when my alarm went off to wake up, I was like, you have to be kidding me. Like I do not want to get up right now. But at least I'm getting my nails done because that's, that's important. I still have the white the white nails with the one like the French tip thing going on so I think I'm gonna do something just nude classic simple plain boring for a trip just because I like that look and I think it'll look good nice and clean so anyways and it'll match my toes because my toes are still um, done in like the nude color with like glitter on it so I might do something to kind of match that Oh, she's pulling in the parking lot, so I will check in with you guys later. I know I have to go do my aunt's hair later today as well, so probably see you guys sometime around then. I almost just said a good morning because I just woke up from my much needed nap. I was so tired. I like, I honestly could have slept a lot more. I only slept like an hour and a half maybe, but I... I definitely could have slept way longer, but I woke up just to see what time it was, like kind of forced myself to wake up almost, just to see what time it was, and I was like, I need to wake up. If I don't wake up, I'm not going to sleep tonight, and I was on like about 5 o'clock when I woke up, so I laid down about 3.30 or so. Anyways, I got my nails done, and I did go out and do my great aunt's hair and painted her toenails for her and came home and spent a few minutes with my husband before he had to go to work and then I uh, ate some lunch and went and laid down and passed out and now I'm just chilling and trying to be alive <laughs> I'm struggling to be awake right now like I so badly want to just like lay back down and go back to sleep but I know if I do like fell asleep so early for my nap like that I would end up not sleeping super late and I would be up super early and I would just end up throwing my sleep schedule off. So anyways, I'm just trying to wake up and I have editing and stuff I need to get done. <sighs> but now I can't stop yawning. Also, yeah, I did get my nails done. I should show you what they look like. 
I don't know that it'll focus on my nails because my face is right here, but just some nice nude pink and then my ring finger and my thumb have just some really like white silver glitter on it. And uh, yeah, so just a nice simple nude nails. It'll be perfect for vacation. And they match my toes pretty well. And yeah, I, like I said, I am just trying to wake up and <laughs> be alive. I got like three and a half hours of sleep last night. So I'm, I'm really tired. Luckily, I don't have to be anywhere tomorrow, so I can sleep in late. But as of right now, I need to do some editing and be productive. I really need to fold my laundry. It's been washed since Sunday, and it's still sitting there. So I need to fold that, and I got things to do. <laughs> I really need to be productive. Good morning. I just filled out my water for the morning, but today... I am getting ready to leave my house to go get my oil changed. It is that time. Get my oil changed. Actually, I should have probably got it done a couple of weeks ago, but I didn't. So I'm going to get it done now. I'm going to go see my dad, and he's going to do it for me. And then I'm going to come back to the house and get my laundry together. Maybe do a little bit of editing. I don't know what I'm going to do, but hang around the house for a little bit. And then, um,. I'm gonna do my laundry today, like that is all I got going on today. Don't have a real exciting day planned. And yesterday, I didn't actually film at all yesterday. It's actually been a few days since I filmed. Yesterday, I pretty much just like laid around the house all day, just chilled, watched my show. And then my mom did actually come over for dinner. She picked up some like jalapeno popper burgers and jalapeno poppers and pasta salad from a local like store thing here in town so she came, brought that over and it was like the full meal and you had to bake the jalapeno poppers and then you did have to like make the patties and cook them but it like had all the instructions and everything was made for you aside from like the patties actually being cooked so anyways yeah she brought that over for dinner and we had that um, my dad was working out in the shop last night, so she came over. My dad didn't, but I had a nice little evening last night, but, like, that was all we did yesterday. I think I waited till, like, 20 minutes or less before my mom was supposed to be here to, before I even got dressed. And then I was like, I better, like, take out the trash and empty the dishwasher. And so that's literally what I was doing when she walked through the door. Like, I did nothing yesterday. I was so lazy. Um, probably, honestly, I was just catching up on sleep and whatnot from being up so late and having to get up so early the day before <sighs> yeah so i'm gonna finish filling up my water here and then i think i'm gonna head out the door real soon i'm gonna my dad here in just a little bit well my oil change was successful got my laundry all done I spent pretty much the whole afternoon with my mom i got to my parents house about noon gave my dad a haircut and did my laundry and watched shrek one and two love those movies haven't seen them in a while but i forgot how freaking good they are like they're hilarious and they have good music like i don't know who picked out the music for those movies but they did a great job i love me some shrek so anyways watch that and then my mom and i um back a couple years ago watched like the first three seasons of money heist in one weekend like two days and then shortly after that, the fourth season of Money Heist came out. And so we've been watching Money Heist together. Well, the fifth season is now out. So we spent the rest of the day after I watched the Shrek movies, because she actually laid down to take a nap because she had a headache for a while. Um, so I feel like a hair on my face or something. Anyways, so then she laid down and watched Shrek. So then after Shrek, when she got up, we watched Money Heist together. The, last, the fifth season. And it's on Netflix. If you guys haven't seen it, it's actually really, really good. It is dubbed in English. It was originally shot in Spanish. So if that bothers you, then you might not like it. But I think they do a really, really good job of, like, lining up the voices and stuff. So even though they don't line up 100% because they're not speaking the same language, it's honestly really, really good. I really enjoy it. So... I totally recommend Money Heist on Netflix if you guys haven't seen it. I feel like that is something I want to just talk to you guys about, but I can't remember. Oh, the drink. So, 
Um, the little footage you guys see when we're pulling into Portland, I'm be drinking a Starbucks drink. That is the like apple crisp or crisp apple. I think it's called apple crisp macchiato from Starbucks. Do not recommend it at all. Both my aunt and I got one. We got it iced and it's just was not good. It was super bitter unless you had the like syrupy stuff on the bottom super mixed in and it really doesn't like dissolve as many times as you like mix it in it just keeps settling on the bottom but like that was the only way that the drink tasted semi good otherwise it was super bitter and not that great and it also had like a really weird like sour smell to it almost like sour milk kind of so I don't recommend it maybe I'll have to try it hot and see if that's any better but I'm not a big hot coffee drinker unless it's like just out of the Keurig and even then I have to be in the right mood for it and lately I have been um, so maybe I will be I don't know but yeah we I, I do not recommend it guys it really was not very good and my friend when we picked her up uh, I was still sipping on the last of it and she asked her what we were drinking and if it, what we thought about it she's like I haven't heard anybody say anything good about it so there's that I hadn't talked to anybody about it my mom had just sent me like a few weeks ago a week or two ago the advertisement for it and I was like oh that sounds good so my aunt and I were like alright let's try it not good at all my mom's like yeah I tried the hot one it wasn't good and I was like why didn't you tell me we wasted our money on these drinks that weren't very good so yeah I think that was what I was gonna tell you guys. Uh, I think I'm gonna go ahead and close this vlog out here. It's late Saturday night now. I'm gonna start a new vlog tomorrow probably because I'm only gonna film like through part of Thursday. That way I can get the vlog edited and up for you guys so it'll be up on Sunday because we're leaving Thursday night for our trip. So next week's vlog will also be kind of short. I know this week's vlog was actually a little bit short other than the concert really had a very laid back week which I kind of wasn't expecting. I was expecting to do a lot more this weekend and we just didn't. So anyways guys I hope you liked this video. If you did then give it a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you in my next video. Bye.